Hello everyone, uh, Kingdom Kid here with a reaction to the Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase that is happening today on June 28th. Uh, it's going to be roughly around 20 minutes, maybe close to 30 minutes, so I'm excited. Uh, there's going to be some good stuff happening, so let's just start. Raid RP to M, okay. Uh, Persona has been heavily, um, heavily rumored, so they could announce the Persona 3, 4, and 5 uh games here so i'm excited for that let's just uh let's watch it when mankind is consumed by darkness and the uh, land falls monster into hunter chaos, okay this is monster hunter nothing bad with that nothing bad with that monster hunter shall rise from people like earth. monster hunter i think monster hunter is in a my kind of game at least from what i've played from like a demos and such like that i i realize i don't really fully get it Sunbreak. Yep, Monster Hunter Rise, Sunbreak. Uh, I think it's coming out in July, right? Free tile update one, okay. God, a new monster. Seething Blaze Gas. I mean, August. Or no, Sunbreak is already out. It's just that there's a title update for it. And then there's one coming in the fall, winter, and then one in 2023. To be continued. Alright. Oh no, it's coming out. Okay, Mass Effect. Okay, it's literally coming out like two days from now. Then you can play a demo of it. Not bad. Alright. Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. In this presentation, we'll be focusing on Nintendo Switch games launching this year from our publishing and development partners. This year, okay. okay. Let's get into the headlines. The battle. Oh my god, that was another thing too! Near Automata was coming to the Switch! That's crazy! The year is 5012 AD. Machine life forms have that is oh my lord that's fucking crazy and forcing humans to take refuge on the that moon. was another thing too I kind of forgot about that too like I literally saw this now yes yesterday that was like oh yeah the the, prepared to stand and that's another thing too like um invaders. Metroid Prime trilogy getting announced or something a or not announced but like to point out for October that but that's always like a rumor that spreads like every Android single year like oh Metroid key Prime Trilogy squad. expected to come out for Switch this November, so that's always something that's Machine always been like rumored. But conflict with androids. That's pretty cool that you guys can finally uh, have emotional battle. damage. Um, I'm curious now. Are, does that mean they're gonna bring um this version replicant of the award then too? Near Automata comes with previously released content, including additional modes and costumes. New costumes exclusive to the Nintendo Switch version will also be available at launch. Oh, hey, those are the costumes Reclaim from the freaking, um, uh, from the, the, the thing in 14. Launching on the Nintendo Switch system October, October okay, 6th. okay, that's cool. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Not cloud version either, so. A maze of deceptions. Murder mystery. A palace of memories. Get ready to immerse yourself in surreal riddles and a chilling story in this modern take on puzzle adventure games. This seems interesting. Solve the enigma of Lorelei and the Laser Eyes, launching first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next year. Ah, oh, interesting. Okay. Familiar faces are making a splash in Classic these characters games. on Nintendo Switch. Bomberman! A new Bomberman game is coming to Nintendo Switch. This time, a bombastic new mode called Castle Mode enters the fray. Super Bomberman R2? Must blast uh, their way to treasure chests, 
while one defending player tries to hold them off. Set up your defense wisely to blow away opponents. Uh, Literally. Okay. You can also create and share so your own battle this, I'm, I'm trying to remember. Because I remember like, there was another R2 bomb man that came out like. On Nintendo Switch next year. That's cool. Ten Mega Man, Man Battle game. Network games originally released on the Game Boy Advance system are coming to Nintendo Switch. What? You control Mega Man in grid-based Mega Mega Man Battle, Battle Network games. Devastating abilities. Yo. This collection I've never a played. Over one thousand. I played a little bit of one of them. I don't even remember which one it was, but that's cool. Over one hundred and fifty songs from across the series. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The full collection will also be digitally available as Volume 1 and Volume 2 each sold separately. A remake of Pac-Man World is coming soon. Pac-Man World Pac-Man's Pac family has been kidnapped. To rescue them, he okay. sets off for Ghost Island. Eating dots isn't all you can do here. I don't think I've ever played Pac-Man World, Trials but enemies with this Pac looks dots, cool. The rev roll, the butt bounce, and a giant Pac-Man? From high-speed chases to galactic escapades, you'll explore all sorts of zany levels. Save the Pac-Fan in Pac-Man World Repack, launching on Nintendo Switch August 26th. Two unlikely friends. One oh, incredible this journey. Pretty. This reminds me of that one game that came out a uh, late last year. A fawn and a wolf year. cub must work together to find a way home across the snowy wilderness in the handcrafted world of Blanc. In this emotional adventure, these unlikely friends must coordinate and use their individual strengths to solve environmental puzzles and navigate through the frigid wilds. Blanc is a completely text-free story with local and online co-op play, so oh. all players can enjoy it. <coughs> Lock, huh? Aww. Forge an unexpected bond in Blanc. Blanc. Launching as a February, console okay. exclusive on Nintendo Switch February 2023. That looks... Oh, it's got my gearbox, okay. A swashbuckling adventure returns. Shanti? No. Pirating is in my blood. Like adrenaline or stale grog. I've been in enough scraps to fill a dozen scrapbooks. I've got stories about ships, fights, love, treasure, betrayal, and root beer. But how about one that has all of the above? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. And this is a story about the time I finally found the secret of Monkey Island. Oh, return to secret Monkey Island. Or it's, or it's Monkey Island. There was a return to Monkey Island. Guy brush three wood. Turn to Monkey Island. There it is. Yep. Not Monkey bad. around in Return to Monkey Island, launching first for consoles on Nintendo Switch this year. Next, we have some news about a game that was announced last June. Please take a look. Okay. Mario and the Rabbit. Oh yeah. Stop for a galactic adventure. I think this got leaked. It's coming Mario out in October. Space is in a universe of trouble when otherworldly enemies suddenly appear. Their goal? Take the energy possessed by sparks, these mysterious creatures. Sparks now are our heroes rabid must stars. Set out to save them. I mean, it sells. It's not a my kind of game, and epic I'll never awaits. forget the rabbits for killing the Rayman series. 
Mario plus rabbits sparks of yeah, there it is Rocket coming out in October the Nintendo switch system October 20th pre-orders begin today Again, uh, on Nintendo Ubisoft Shop. leaked it themselves check out Ubisoft special showcase tomorrow for more details about Mario special plus rabbits sparks of hope we hope you're looking forward to the chaotic adventures of Mario and the rabbits let's take a look at more headlines There's something for everyone. There's on Nintendo something Switch. for everyone, is there? During a storm, young alchemist Noah crash lands in ancient ruins. The layout of these little Noah, ruins Zion of Paradise. Every time you enter them, this is definitely a square game. Uh, this reminds me so much of Bravely Default. Maybe it's not a square game, but it reminds me of Bravely Default in a way. And perform powerful elemental attacks to defeat foes. Little Noah, Scion of Paradise, launches on Nintendo Switch later today. Oh, it's coming out today. That's cool. It looks interesting. All aboard! In the management sim Railgrade, you'll build railway systems mm, to efficiently okay, rail. transport cargo. It's, it's basically and train tycoon. Economic Join aspiring game creator Kenta in a hand-drawn adventure RPG to time. save the world in his latest creation, The Legend of Right. Oh, Taking place in charming. Kenta's notebook, this RPG spans over that, 200 um, pages where you must There's draw, another game that's coming erase, out, I think, later this year. Maybe it's coming out next year or something where you kind of take control of a character in a book and then he goes out of the book. It just seems to be every time you all in the books page. and such. It's RPG cool. Time, it's cute. I like it. Of right. Unfolds onto Nintendo Switch August 18th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Spin dash into a new zone. All right, Sonic Frontiers. Let's see what Sonic's you've got. Sonic's latest action adventure kicks off on the vibrant Starfall Islands, home to a mysterious civilization. Here, you can freely dash through a vast open zone, taking full advantage of Sonic's speedy skills. It looks a little bit better than what I've seen before, which wasn't a lot. Lock on and attack enemies. I haven't been paying way. too much attention about this Take game, but hey. Trigger combos and it looks decent. Damage. It looks decent enough. With good timing, you can even deflect enemy attacks. Acquire skills to bolster Sonic's arsenal of moves. You can also enter a special zone called Cyberspace. Take on challenges at supersonic speeds. Okay, so this seems like progress. the quote unquote traditional. Those seem like the traditional ways of like, you know, like Sonic Generations and stuff like that. What okay. What Sonic on these strange islands? Oh, Sonic so there's Frontiers our antagonist. Onto Nintendo Switch this this holiday? holiday? Okay. I don't know, I might pick it up. We'll see. Live magically alongside your Disney and Pixar friends. I think I remember this game being Dreamlight announced Valley beforehand. Was once an idyllic land where Disney Dreamlight and Pixar Valley. characters lived in harmony. I think I remember this being until announced. Until the forgetting turned this dream into a nightmare. Now, it's up to you to help these iconic residents recover their lost memories and reveal the secrets that led you here. Bring the magic back to Dreamlight Valley in this mesmerizing life simulation adventure. Explore this land's many diverse realms so bad. and forge lasting huh? friendships with heroes and villains alike. <laughs> Everyone you meet will have personal stories to discover and adventures to complete. Help them out by exploring, giving them gifts, and performing other fun activities. In this world, you can be whoever you dream yourself to be. Uh, Disney that, Dreamlight oh, Valley access, launches okay. on Nintendo Switch September 6th as an early access title. Take these adventures with you on the go. All right, more headlines. Live, live Alive, live that's coming out coming later in July. July I'm actually Multiple excited for this. Featuring different protagonists. I don't know how I'm going to like if I'm going to cover the game or not or HD how I'm going to do that. A demo with the start of three chapters, Imperial China, Twilight of Edo Japan, and The Distant Future will be available on Nintendo eShop later today. Begin three chapters save and save data, from the data demo transfers. Can be transferred okay. to the full game once purchased. Doraemon, Nobi, and their friends land on an unknown planet Doraemon? and decide to help a new friend fulfill his dreams by farming, plow the fields, harvest crops, and tend to the animals. 
You can even use Doraemon's secret gadgets to farm in a flash. Relax by living with friends, eating delicious meals, oh, this is and cute. fishing. And with local play, you and a pal can build a ranch together. Doraemon Story of Seasons, Friends of the Great Kingdom launches on the Nintendo Switch system this year. The world Minecraft. of Minecraft meets action strategy gameplay in Minecraft Legends. Oh yeah, Minecraft Legends. That got announced. A beautiful land surrounded by rich nature is invaded by again. enemies oh, yeah, from the another Xbox dimension. Showcase. It's a treasure hey, hunter's paradise. Hey, dragon, uh, dragon quest treasure. Two siblings hunter. dream of collecting grand Two, treasures like that. from around Yeah, the dragon world. quest treasures. Yeah, Adventure I remember them the announcing this game. I might pick it up. We'll see. Treasure hunters. In this Dragon Quest series spin-off, you'll recruit a variety of well-mannered monsters to join but you on a marvelous plan is adventure. Arrogant, so that's not actually with their cool. help, and with your trusty fortune finder, locating loot will be a breeze. Monsters are perfect travel buddies for exploring this vast world. Bounce on a slime to reach high ledges, or dangle from a drachy to glide over gaping chasms. Support your monsters in battle as they fearlessly fend off foes. Bring your hard-earned haul back to your base and see how much it's I worth. Can't. Collect more riches to expand your base and increase your treasure hunting level. X marks the spot when Dragon Quest Treasures launches on December, Nintendo Switch okay. December 9th. I might pick that up again. We'll see. Fire Emblem. All right, here's like a showcase of some stuff. No Man's Sky, is that Plague's a Plague's Tale? Yeah, that's Plague's Tale. That's coming out later. Three Hopes, yeah, we've been playing that. Uh, that's live streamed if you guys listen to that every Wednesday and Saturday at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. No Man's Sky coming out October 7th. Plague's Tale Requiem, Cloud version. Yep, that's coming out in October. Cloud version, though. I'll be playing on my PlayStation for that. Captain Velvet Meter. All right, seems interesting. It's like one of those. Okay. We're going to have so much fun together. At first, your participation Portal. is appreciated. This was already announced for Switch, alright, wasn't it? Portal, uh, it was like a Portal and Portal, portal 2 collection, right? Collection will be available later today. Oh, it's gonna be uh, available later today, I think that's what they said. Collection. But oh well. Let's get started, you monster. Yeah, okay, that's cool. Farm. Fight and forge friendships in a new fantasy world. Welcome to Leafy. Got like three a minutes left. I don't think they're gonna announce Persona. I don't think they're gonna Your announce story Persona. begins here in this but brand we'll new see. We'll life see. simulation RPG. Do a little farm Another farming simulated. Cook and craft items. And trek through the fields to collect materials. All while meeting townsfolk along the way. The seasons gently flow from spring, summer, fall, and winter. However, they will give way to the season of death. Quietus. Quietus? Crops wither. That withers life. Life is threatened. Find a way to stop the season of death from wreaking havoc on your home. I like the art style. The fate of the village depends on you. Begin your new life in Harvestella, launching Harvestella on Nintendo November Switch 4th. November 4th. It seems interesting. And of course, the Spice Quest. This next segment will be our last announcement. Please take a look. All right, here we go. Last announcement. Ah, here we are. Start. Here we are. Coming at ya. I'm 
Morgana, reigning ace of the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. And today, I'm bringing along an ultra top secret video. Is it cloud versions though? I hope you're ready. On October 21st, 20, yep. Here we go. Now King Goomba can shut up. But is it gonna be cloud version? Yup, Persona 5 Royal will launch up the Nintendo Switch October 21st. And that's not all. Let's keep the ball rolling, huh, Teddy? Not the cloud, yep, here we are. It's nice not the cloud version, but here we down. are. Personas are coming okay, to the everyone. Switch. Check this out. There we go. Persona finally available on everything, which is perfect. Better believe it. Persona 4 Golden and Persona 3 Portable are also coming. There we go. Your eyes peeled for more Persona on Nintendo Switch. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. Thank there we you go. For Finally, it's coming out for the Switch, everyone. All right, I'd say this is a pretty decent Nintendo Direct Mini. I mean, a lot of good themes. I mean, Nier Automata. Um, I, I know this was a more of a partner showcase, so it wouldn't really show first party stuff like, you know, Metroid and stuff like that. Um, so I, I'm, that, um, of course, Persona is probably the big thing in my opinion. Um, Persona is the big thing that they showed. Um, Near Automata coming, which is, it's strange that it's Near Automata, and I kind of expected, oh, are they going to show Near Replicant as well, but... No, I guess not. So there's that. Um, so you had Near Automata, you have Near Replicant. Um, I lost the signal, but yeah. So yeah. yeah. Again, I I'm glad that the, these games yeah. these games are coming out for the Switch. I'm it's Morgana, more people experiencing Persona is a good parts. thing. Um, and today, and I I hope a lot of people do get to experience this. Um, whether they play it on Xbox or I PlayStation or Switch or PC. It being out for everything is great, and I can't wait for. Again, uh, I. I don't know. Like, I kind of like. I hope they put like a little immo uh, like immemorial thing for Billy, uh, the voice actor for Doctor Maruki, uh, in Persona Five Royals thing, because he passed away sadly a few weeks ago. So if they put like nice, a little in the morning, like Morgana. in loving memory of him okay, too, everyone. at like the end of the credits, that'd be that'd out. be a nice little touch. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited for Persona. Um, I don't think I'd buy him for the Switch version, but I'm definitely getting for my PlayStation. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll we'll get him from the Switch. I don't know. We'll see. Um, they're all sold separately. So there's that. Um. But the fact that I've like always like I I basically have always bought every single version of Persona that I could, so. <laughs> but nope, I'm excited. Keep your eyes peeled for so, more Persona. I'm I'm excited. So. Switch. All right, guys, what do you think? Um, I I would That's say that Nintendo the Direct Mini big Partner thing Show. that I liked, like I said, was Persona, uh, Near Automata. Um, the Mega Man stuff looks pretty cool as well. Battle Network. Um. So, yeah, I'd say it was some good stuff. All right, guys. Thank you all for watching this uh, this uh, video of me reacting to this mini direct. Uh, okay, why did you do that? But, yeah, guys, uh, thank you for watching this. Uh, and, um, yeah, uh, Monster Hunter will look good, too. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to cut some of this stuff down to get rid of it. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And let me know what you guys like the most out of this. Thank you all for watching this video, and I will see you guys next time.